Uh, well, Ziltera is a what they call a semiconductor uh, foundry. Yeah. What we do is we fabricate uh, integrated circuits or chips for design companies that do not have the resources, that do not have uh, the, the very expensive uh, resources to, to fabricate their integrated circuits on silicon. Uh, it is what they call a front end of the semiconductor uh, industry. Uh, what we do is that we take designs from our customers, we then translate those designs into silicon uh, from concept to reality. Yeah? Beyond that, after we've fabricated it, we pass it down to the lower part of the value chain, the, the packaging, assembly, and test, and so on. In Siltera, we have eight guys with PhDs. Okay. Yeah. Already or you're, you're Already. sponsoring them? Okay. Yeah. Already, yeah. Uh, eight guys with PhDs. This, uh, some of our uh, uh, you know, managers and senior vice presidents were formerly with uh, Bell Labs, for example. Okay. Yeah. So these are very uh, uh, places renowned for, for research. Yeah. Uh, we have more than 50 with Masters of Engineering, Masters of Science. Okay. Yeah. And today, uh, I'm, I'm glad to, to, to share with you, the Ministry of Higher Education has uh, approved 18 uh, pr uh, researchers from uh, Silterra to, to go on to the so-called My Brain 15 program where our people will be doing industrial PhDs okay. and masters with the universities. So I must say, I think this must be by company, we, sh we Largest, could be uh, the hi highest number of, yeah. Me, if I may add, yes. you know, the work with CREST is also part of that program. Yeah? Okay, how so? So we have a <coughs> program with CREST where, you know, CREST does provide some, some some support for, for, for our research programs, especially those areas where it's, it's uh, what I call non-competitive areas yet, yeah? more fundamental, more, uh, more generic. So we don't mind sharing what we do through CRES with the rest of the university community, uh, for, or for that matter, the, the greater Malaysian manufacturing and industrial community. Uh, what, what difference has CRES made, you know, in, in how you guys are trying to compete out there now? Mm -hmm. Well, um, CRES itself is a very recent uh, you know, creation and Siltera is one of the founding members founding of CRES. Members. Yeah. So, uh, in our industry, it's very intense, intense in research and development. You know, the, and through CRES, we hope to, to share some risk yeah, in terms of doing this uh, development. Uh, I mentioned the fact that there are some uh, I call it non-competitive area, yes. more generic areas that uh, we can work with CREST. One area perhaps is uh, the area of, uh, in terms of manufacturing, we, there's an area called industrial engineering okay. where you, you try to, to, to efficiently use your resources to have the maximum output at the shortest possible time. So the area of industrial engineering is something that we applied under the CRES program, okay. and this can be applied to all other manufacturing, uh, you know, um, organizations. Okay. Yeah. So the, the generic knowledge there can be shared. Another area is in environmental management. Okay. As you know, uh, you know, um, fabricating ICs require a lot of gases, yeah. chemicals that are rather nasty, but yeah. needs to be you know managed properly. Yeah. So through CRES, we know that, for example, our neighbors uh, are, and another foundry would also be using the same kind of chemicals and, and so on and so forth. And perhaps we can, working with CRES, you know, we can help solve that problem too. You know? Collectively. Yeah. Collectively. And that's lower our, you know, our manufacturing costs cost. eventually. Yeah. So that's, right. how, that's the intention. That's how it helps. Huh? Yeah. Okay, very good. Thanks a lot, Dr. Gay. Thank you.